Yep, get a help. Well, next step now that the go kart's painted is to take the old covering off those cracked and leaky seats and put on a fresh covering of vinyl that's probably just as old, at least 30 years, that I got from the dead guy who I got that old 76 New Yorker from. Right? Ready to cut everything now. Just got to lay it on there and cut it bigger. Peel it over the edges of the wood and tack and glue it down. Pretty simple, just fold the vinyl over the foam and put tacks on it to hold it down. Done. Simple as that. Had a little help from my kitty helpers. Sweet. Beautiful. Now for the wiring. Righty, things are looking great. Got a pair of front wheels and they actually came already painted black so that'll go well with the black highlights. Got the seat all done and installed. Both fenders are painted. So far, so good. And the underside has the truck, truck bed liner stuff on it too and both fenders so looks like we're all ready for reassembly and wiring now. Oh, she's wanting to go bad now. But I still haven't got the right wheels for it yet. The size I'm looking for is 16, 8, 7. 7 inch rim, 8 inch width, 16 inch total height. On steel rims or aluminum rims, just smooth kind. Haven't been able to find them, even looking through the order books at the local quad dealers here in London. Something with a fair to medium aggressive tread pattern. You know, but not like a paddle tie or anything. Good for dirt and road. Just imagine with a nice set of back wheels. Black. And with fuel economy in mind, that's our alternate engine option. <laughs> Not! And just a little spray test. I got my exact match dupla color, plum crazy purple, for my gas tank to make it just as original. Just got to sand the primer on it, paint it, clear coat it, and install it. Sweet. Nice. Beep, beep.